What's good, everybody? Today we are here to talk about a bunch of different grant opportunities for you guys that are in business, whether you're just getting started or whether you have a business already up and running and operating. Now, grants are going to be free money that you can get access to to fund different aspects of your business. And they're also they also can be used to help your business grow. Um, and do different things like I said that you want to do in your business. A lot of times for grants, um, you will see that they are for different people groups, uh, for people in different situations, for people in different industries, for people that live in certain states. Um, sometimes they're international, sometimes they're not. So today again, as I mentioned, we're going to talk about different options uh, that will apply to different uh, groups of you guys. So make sure you're listening to all of the grants that I have to mention to you guys. And a lot of you guys um, ask me if I actually help with the grants. Um, and some of you guys uh, take offense to the fact that I don't help specifically to help you apply for the grants. But um, the reason that I'm doing these videos is to show you where the money is. I'm pretty sure that if there was money buried in your backyard and you had no idea that it was there and I knew that it was there, you would want me to tell you if the money if the money was there and where the money is and you wouldn't be upset if I didn't offer to help you dig up the money as long as I told you where the money was. So that's what I'm doing with these videos to help you guys in business that need the free money uh, for your business to help get started. But know that a lot of grants also do want you to already have a registered business. So a lot of them will want you to have, you know, went to your secretary of state where you live and already have filed for your LLC, your corporation. Um, and if you go ahead and do that part in business, then you will be able to qualify for more grants. So it's not going to hurt you to do so. Um, you know, when it comes to business, sometimes you do have to do some investment of money upfront in order to operate your business, in order to make money in your business and to get free money for your business. Um, a lot of grants will also be competition style. Some will be application based where you just apply and see if you get it. Some you have to submit videos and stuff like that. So there are different ways of getting grants and some of them are private. Some of them are also from the government, which the government ones can be hard to get. Now, what I want you guys to know before we get into the grants is that I will recommend somebody that can help you with grants if you need somebody to hold your hand and go through that process. But uh, one thing that I do specialize in is actually helping business owners to increase their business revenue so that they can actually have money coming in and not just rely on free money all the time, uh, which is what you want to ultimately do in business anyway. So if you're interested in help like that, I have a free Facebook group called Two Week Notice. I'll put a link to it in the description and I actually have information where I talk to a couple of grant specialists and have some recordings of that so you can get information on that as well as the other business information to help grow your business. And uh, let's go ahead and dive into the information on the grants uh, that you can get for your business now. Okay. And really pay attention to all of the opportunities because I'm going to show you some things from getting your business established and getting the money that you need to do some of the things that you want to do with your business. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. First off, if you want somebody to hold your hand and help you with getting funding and getting grants, then I always recommend a company called Skip. The reason why I recommend Skip is because they give out free money themselves. They give out grants on a monthly basis you have very minimal requirements that you have to meet for this and because they give out grants on a monthly basis you always have an opportunity to get free money uh, all you have to do is come to their website uh, you can see I'll link it I'll put a link to them uh, in the description but you can see uh, up here will be an option for you to register and once you register you can see all of the grant opportunities that they know about you can register for grants that they offer and you can get free money now if you want them to actually help you secure other grants and even you know loans and stuff like that there are three ways that skip can help you uh, funding help get expert support to help you navigate and apply for your available grant loan 
uh, and financing options. They help you with formation, so step-by-step -step help in considering and executing on formation or certification options, and they help you grow your business as well. So hands-on support to help you grow your customers, build a business plan, or figure out new marketing and growth strategies. So there are three different ways that they can help you. If you actually want them to help you and handhold you through those steps, you do have to pay. They do have a paid for a service for that. But if you just want to see what free opportunities they have for money, go to their site that I'll link below, register with them, and start applying for those free grants. Just so that you know, for April, um, on April 25th, so just in four days, they're going to be announcing uh, winners for those who wanted to win a $500 mini grant that they were giving away this month. Um, and they're going to give it to five different people. So all you have to do again is register for free. And then you can apply for this $500 mini grant. At least five of you have the possibility to win it. All you have to do is be a US based small business owner and at least 18 years old. And you can be an entrepreneur. You don't have to actually be a business owner for their grants, which is for you guys that are just getting started or may not have registered your business yet. This is your opportunity to get some money here. Um, uh, you must be a subscriber to their YouTube channel, which they give out a lot of free information and they announce grant winners on there. Uh, you must have the skip account that I mentioned, so you must register on their website, which I will link below. And again, on April 24th, um, you have to enter by April 24th and they will announce it on April 25th. So if you want to get a free grant from Skip or try to see about getting that, go ahead and register, apply, and see how that works out for you. I actually do, uh, can't say that I have gotten money from Skip. I won a $1,000 grant from them before a couple years ago. So they definitely do give out money and they definitely are a good resource whether you use their paid services or not. So just wanted to make sure you guys knew about that. Now the next grant opportunity that you're gonna hear about is going to be from Inkfile. Inkfile is a place where you can actually go to register your business. So if you, uh, let's say you win the money from Skip for that grant, then you can actually use that money to go pay to file your business in your state, whether you do LLC, a corporation, or you know something a little bit different. But Inkfile also has a grant. They have two different grant opportunities, actually. Uh, this first one is for young entrepreneurs. So for those that are in school currently, this is a, a way for those young uh, entrepreneurs to get a grant. They are giving out $2,500 to those students that may be seeking a grant for entrepreneurship. The deadline uh, is March 31st for uh, that round that they had last, but also June 30th, and then there's another round that you have to register by September 30th for. So the next deadline is going to be June 30th. So if you are in that category, then here's the grant option for you there. And also, you know, you must have a GPA of 3.0. You must be a U.S. based high school or trade school or university student. So you can be in college, high school or in trade school to qualify for this. Um, so uh, it's our high school senior. So keep that in mind. You can also be a graduate as well. So in graduate school um, and you must have an interest in starting a business. Now, there's also the opportunity for those that aren't, you know, in school. So it's the Fresh Start Business Grant. And with that, you also need to take note that you get for free the ability to file on Inc. Files Gold Plan. So you can actually file and register your business for free if you get this grant from them. So you get filing for free. So if you were you know, struggling to get the money to file, here's an opportunity for you there. And you get $2,500 to put toward your startup costs. So this doesn't matter what business industry you're in. So I asked a lot of you guys before to comment what industries you're in and you gave me a lot of different industries. And again, whatever industries you are looking for grants for, make sure you put those down in the comments so I can know when I see those grant opportunities come up because they don't always pop up all the time or they're not always available all the time for everybody's industry. So when I do see those, I know to make a video about it. And I have one that I'm going to get into in just a second from you guys' comments. Now, uh, again, you can register your business for free if you get this grant and get money towards your startup costs. And they have an opportunity for students and those of you who are you know, just getting started with a regular business who may not be a student that is in the 21 years old range. This is for U.S. residents and you must be planning to start a new business or grow an existing business. So you don't have to already be in business for this one as well. So this is another opportunity for those of you guys who are just trying to get your businesses started and off the ground. 
Now this next opportunity is going to actually be for a scholarship for those of you that are in the beauty industry. Now that doesn't just limit you to uh, you know the regular beauty categories that you might be thinking about. There are different um, actual opportunities that they have under the beauty category. So let's take a look at what those are. So you can see here that they have scholarships for those of you that are in cosmetology. They got aesthetics, which is your estheticians, I believe, I don't really know. Uh, licensed professional is the category that they have. They also have nail technology and barbers. So if you are anywhere in this category, you can get a scholarship to help pay for your training that you're going through to get your license. So with these particular scholarship opportunities, we'll go to the calendar so you can see what's available. Pretty much all of these the deadlines or the application dates are between March and May 31st. So you have until next month to apply for these. They have different amounts depending on you know what category or industry specifically you're in under beauty. But you see aesthetics, they have 5,000, cosmetology 5,000, and they have different uh, sponsors of these different grants. Uh, you see JCS Beauty there, 5,000 for cosmetology, and they got L'Oreal for cosmetology as well. Uh, you can see here they have European Wax Center for um, cosmetology or aesthetics. There's one for aesthetics and nail technology. Again, all of these are deadlined at May, the end of May. We also have nails specifically there. Uh, there's more aesthetics, cosmetology, uh, advanced education that one has already passed there's cosmetology barbering and hair design that is sixty five hundred dollars um this one for aesthetics is actually twenty dot uh twenty thousand dollars and also cosmetology one fifteen thousand dollar winner and two five thousand uh, dollar winners of those so you can see there's various different opportunities for scholarship now that means that you can get with these particular scholarships you can get uh, up to this amount to go towards your tuition you have to already be enrolled at some accredited school to get your license and you have to be at least 50 percent through the program so with this one you would have already had to be enrolled you would have already had to pay for tuition but they will reimburse you all the way up to the amounts that you see here based on which grant you apply for i'm sorry scholarship you apply for so you can at least get that money back and get the rest of your schooling taken care of so just know that this is an opportunity if you are still working towards one of these fields you can get some money back so that's free money so of course why not mention that here now let's go into some more free grant opportunities that you can actually use towards your business uh, since that was just about your education and your licensing for that specific industry now we have here hello alice the small business growth fund is another grant opportunity recipients can receive anywhere from five thousand to twenty five thousand for this particular grant opportunity and this one is very very important for you to jump on asap because the application is closed today at 6 p.m eastern time so when you're seeing this video if you want to apply for this one, make sure you go ahead and apply for this as soon as you can. Now, in order to apply for this one, you must be a for-profit business located and registered in one of the 50 United States, Puerto Rico, or District of Columbia, and you must have made less than a million dollars in 2022, and also a committed, oh, I'm sorry, and also must be committed to their customers and community and have a clear plan for how the funds will help them achieve a significant growth in 2023. So again, this one is open to more people. So just know that this is one that you can apply for. And if you want to try to get this, make sure you apply today. Now we're going to go over another opportunity here. Verizon opened up another round of the of their grant that they have the small business digital ready and that one uh, is going to be ten thousand dollars so for this one i really love these types of grants because they give you education it's not enough to just get the free money because you can use that like a lotto ticket just end up blowing it in all the wrong places if you don't have the right guidance so what you will get uh, with this grant is also a uh, personalized learning through over 40 courses that they have mentorship peer networking so you can network with other entrepreneurs and one-on-one -on -one expert coaching and incentives uh, such as of course grant funding so this is a great opportunity it ends on may 12th so you have to apply for this uh, asap of course anything that's coming up on the deadline you want to apply for it asap even if the deadline is further out apply for it asap so you can get your hat in the ring as soon as possible but again this is for uh, this is ten thousand dollars so this is definitely something 
that you want to try to jump on and get for your business, especially because you get that free education with it as well. So jump on that as soon as you can. Now, I wanted to open up another opportunity here for you guys as far as grants go. Now, this is one that you would have to actually pay for a membership for. Now, that might sound unattractive to a lot of you guys, but the reason why I'm bringing this place up is because even though you do have to pay for a membership with them, they continuously have opportunities for grants and it's pretty much a little more open than some other grant opportunities on who this can apply to. So a lot of you guys can get the opportunity to actually get a grant. Now, what you would receive for this current opportunity that they have is up to $4,000. Um, and so what does it cost to be a member? Let's take a look at that real quick because I know that's what you guys are probably asking yourselves. How much does it cost to try to get this money? So basically, you can see here that a annual membership with them is 120 annually. If you paid monthly, it's just $12 a month. So it's not a whole bunch of money, especially if you actually get $4,000, um, you know, 4,000 minus the 120 annually. That's a pretty good amount, I would say, that you would be profiting by paying that to get the opportunity to continuously apply for the opportunities to get grants. Of course, it's not the best option because there are options out there that are free, but I wanted to make sure that you had another option that you know you can go to to try to get some continuous opportunities for grants and funding. And again, if you guys are interested, which you should be in learning how to make your business profitable to the point where you don't have to rely on free money because your business is making money, then go ahead and check out my free business group where you can get all the information that you need on building up your business and get some uh, training that I did with some other grant experts who actually help people with grants and get some of that information on different things you can do with your business and nonprofits in regards to getting grants and using grants in a, a more strategic way than the older way of thinking and just what it usually takes to get approved for grants. All that information is going to be in a group as well as useful business information that nonprofits and for profits can use to get to financial freedom by making a abundance of money in your business. And also, you know, if you work virtually, being able to work virtually and cut yourself free of your job. So that's what you can get in the free group. Thank you guys for sticking around to the end. If you enjoyed this video, give the video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so you'll be notified anytime I let out new videos just like this.